are part of something that is going to change our world. What higher purpose is there? Elizabeth Holmes' mission was not just to transform medicine, but the world. Many compared her to her idol, Steve Jobs. At the age of just 19, she dropped out of Stanford University to form the biotech company Theranos, a combination of the words therapy and diagnosis. Her big invention was going to mean that less people have to say goodbye too soon to people they love. She promised that with just a painless prick of a finger and a few drops of blood, her revolutionary medical technology could analyze multiple diseases in record time. According to Elizabeth, the torture of needles and endless vials of blood would no longer be necessary. And when we do that, we will change our lives. Not surprisingly, the world was captivated. Elizabeth Holmes made the cover of major magazines and attracted gobs of money. At its zenith, Theranos partnered with corporate giants like Safeway and Walgreens to offer its blood tests in their stores. Everything was spectacular on the surface. But in reality, Theranos' employees, some of Silicon Valley's best and brightest, were saying the company was actually a bloody mess. Elizabeth was lying about the accuracy of the blood tests. It's all a show. She didn't want anybody to see what was going on in there. In a panic, I went and bought a burner phone. I called the Wall Street Journal. It was the Journal article in 2015 that first widely exposed the problems at Theranos. Ultimately, Holmes was charged with multiple counts of fraud. She is now awaiting trial with a possible 20 years in prison. And today, shocking new revelations about Elizabeth from the ultimate Theranos insider.